What up, guys? Uh, I'm Eli. You guys might remember me, which might, might remember me having my old Silverado. But uh, I, got, I got rid of that thing. I like that monster gallon. I couldn't afford it for school. Instead, I got a, a true race car. All right. Now, this is a Nissan Sentra SER, as you can tell by the, uh, the badge there. SER. It is a spec V. So, you know, I mean, it is, you know, better suspension for doing the sick turn in your race. As you can see, I got some, uh, some snow here from doing all the sick fucking drifts. So just keep in mind, this is a true race car. Um, yeah, so not much to it. 2.5 engine, racing style. You know, this engine was gonna be in the GTR, but they decided to go something a little more tame. So keep that in mind as well. Uh, it is the Badger front, so you have no idea what it is. Could be a Nissan or Ferrari, who knows? What else we got? We got some uh, nice uh, 240 wheels on it. You see those drill slotted brakes? They're actually really bad, you need to replace them. I'm not going through for a while. Um, has a sunroof, so when you're going crazy fast, you need to get the, the fresh air in. But uh, yeah, oh, check this out too. The inside's kind of gross, but that's okay. Let me uh, show you around here. In true race car fashion, it does have Nismo floor mats. You see that? Niz Nismo. Uh, good shit there. Has a little SER shifter right here. You know, it is a triple clutch dual gearbox. I'll show you guys the, uh, I think it's the beast underneath the hood. It does have a few mods to it. It has a custom aftermarket coolant blow-off valve. So when the coolant pressure gets too high, as you can see here, a little aftermarket work there. Um, I do plan on getting a new radiator, and I will get a header soon because the cast needs to blow up. But really, that's about it. I'm gonna save up money to do my other project, which is the 64 Mercury. But yeah, this is my Sentra SER Spec V. It's a beast on the track and on the streets. That's about it.